Some Tennesseans are in Florida right now waiting to get the go ahead to move into Louisiana and help with the cleanup. Nita Gamash is part of a response team with the Red Cross and she joins us now by telephone. Nita, so you're in Pensacola right now. When will you know where you can go? We actually have had some tentative information and we'll know more tomorrow morning, but the word is we're going out sometime tomorrow morning to either Hattiesburg, Mississippi or somewhere in Louisiana. We left Nashville last Friday and we flew into Tampa and from Tampa we went to Lakeland. We're now hunkered in Pensacola. We, uh, Isaac, of course, passed. We were an advanced team called the Rapid Deployment Team. And now we're going to be dispatched out sometime tomorrow morning. What types of services are you prepared to deliver there? Uh, sure. Everybody is trained in sheltering, feeding, disaster mental health, client services, logistics. Uh, we have what's called the emergency response vehicle. Folks are trained in that. So we're going to provide psychological first aid and also emotional support. Anything that people need uh, immediately after a disaster to try to normalize the experience. How many people from Tennessee do you have there with you? We always see this outpouring from folks here, and they don't call us the volunteer state for nothing. How many folks do you have there? Yeah, it's amazing. We came out with a team of seven people, and there's also another person, so that makes eight out of the Nashville chapter, 14 out of the region around Nashville, and I understand 2,400 uh, across the United States Red Cross volunteers that Tennessee has sent um, eight out of our chapter and 14 out of the region. Great showing of support. Nita Gamash with the Red Cross, thank you for being with us and uh, good luck out there. Keep up the good work. Thank you very much. Well, Nita and those other team members are in Florida preparing to move up the coast. Some other members of the Tennessee Red Cross are now preparing to head south if they are needed. Those dispatched will be using emergency response vehicles like you just saw. They could be serving hot meals, handing out care packages, and of course clearing debris. We are in the volunteer state, so we send a lot of volunteers. Uh, every disaster that happens, generally some of our volunteers will go. So we deploy them out amongst, you know, the closer you are to the disaster, the more chance you have to go. Now, those who would like to help right now can probably make the most hay by sending a donation to the Red Cross. To find out more about that, go to our website, fox17.com, and click on Fox Links. Of course, Fox 17 will continue to check on Isaac, the tropical storm now throughout the newscast. Tennessee Mornings will keep you up to date tomorrow morning on the latest developments from 5 to 9. And you can get additional updates anytime at our website, fox17.com and facebook.com forward slash Fox Nashville.